Um, I wish. Uh, uh, yes, Corbin, appreciate you. Okay. We well, appreciate um, you bringing us here. Tell us yeah, where we are yeah, so I okay. can show everybody. This place is the Brainwood Beach Resort. Um, it's a very nice place. The ocean, as you can see. And then they have a rooms here. A lot of rooms that you can come and rent them at weekends, weekdays. They accept individuals, corporate bodies, organizations. You are all welcome to this place. And especially their food, mm, very tasty. Now, what the tasty. tricky thing is now, people want to know how do we get here? Because Okay, for getting to this place, um, when you get to Ayin Sudu, you just take your Ayin Sudu. Elmina, when you get to Elmina, said you are going to Ayin Sudu. When you get to Ayin Sudu, it takes you your left and straight away to bring you to this place. Uh, I'll get you the number and then I'll put the number, uh, the owner of this place, number to you, Auntie Aggie. This is Ocean View. Thank you. Right, perfect. So I'll show everybody else everything Crop and appreciate it. So, family, once you're coming from Cape Coast, you pass through Elmina and then that's um, Ayan Sudu. And then you're going to drive to the beach. And it took us about, uh, about 10, 15 minutes driving down from the main road to the beach resort. So this is a big space and we're going to show you all of it. Let me show you just a view of the rooms at the very top. These are actually the rooms. And I'll see if we have an opportunity to go inside uh, one of them. And this area is the restroom area. <laughs> so, Kwabna, we're going to be able to see one of the rooms? Yes, we will. All right, so. Yes, my brother. So, family, uh, that's one of those things where you try to find places, and if you're ever doing big events, no? This is the kind of place that you would want, you know, you just have to pre-arrange everything so everything could be organized. And that's how we do our journeys because sometimes, even though you have a nice big resort, it doesn't mean that you're going to have millions of people coming here every week. But the main thing is the accommodations. So where is the where is the that's the bar area, the bar and the main dining. Yeah, uh, take him around. Oh, uh, you know I'm trying to see, I'm trying to get access to one of those rooms. Yeah, we'll have okay, access yes. to one of those rooms. The waves are a little rough, but you know it's a swimming beach, and I'm a swimmer, and that is fine. So right here. The outside bar area, like outside kitchen, dining area, and this is where we came from. And as I'm always mentioning, in tropical paradise, the coconut tree is like the iconic symbol of the tropics. You know, because even when you come down to the beach, it's the it's the survivor of everything else. <laughs> you always see beaches with coconut tree or palm tree, but the coconut trees have all the food on it. You know, some some jelly and coconut juice. But as you can see, it's planted. Nothing else is grown right here. So it's a tree that's really just the strongest of many trees. And coconut trees last for a long time. And you, know, you can always use every aspect of it. Now, including the coconut shell, you know, we're talking about biodiesel, we're talking about uh, just uh, sustainable fuel. You know, all of that is, is like, it's it, family. You know, even the ocean, using ocean or wave technology to power turbines to produce power. So when I'm talking about you building a community and you're using, you have access to the river or a lake and you have access to the ocean and the trees and everything, you're using all of that. That's what we talk about sustainability. You live off the land and you replenish, give back, put back in the land. You cut a tree down, you plant another one. It's 
kind of like if you're farming uh, livestock, you know, you can't just kill all of the cows and everything or all of your chickens and everything. You know, you have to keep a, a process of sustainability going on, you know. So it's a simple science family. You don't have to have PhDs and super scientific and everything is all practical. When we realized we wanted to land in Africa, we realized that, hey, individually, it's a lot of money. Together, we have a whole town, a whole community. And then we can do so much more with our own brothers and sisters. The so family, we're here on brand new beach resort. And I'm just giving you a feel of this nice tropical energy. Yes, my brother Corbina, it's been, it's beautiful. Now the next mission is for us to see one of the rooms. <laughs> Mr. Mr. Bomani Dakari, you have your money? Yes, I already have a big bill. I have only one big bill. You will change it. Get you and your friend, get you and friend something to drink. Mom, 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 please. Son, once you finish right there, I'm going to get back on the bus. Uh, Son, once you finish, you get back on the bus, I get some more, okay? Uh, one. Just get, use that to get what you need to get. Okay. So we're getting the keys right now. It's the son of, and his friends. Keys from what? Oh, the apple. No, the keys, I'm going to go check out one of the rooms. You guys, enjoy yourself a drink. We'll be right back, okay? okay Alright, we're, we're off to a mission to go see yes. one of the rooms, the family. <laughs> hey, y'all, follow us so we can get some photos of the room. And I'm not saying that we're staying in your family because uh, that's not what we're not. You know, we're not doing, but when you have, you know, I do private organizations and reservations and it's all about what you want. And uh, we've been to so many parts of Ghana, you know, and you know, you could add many other countries to it, but we make our way around and we purposely look for black establishment from wherever they're from, from what, whether they're from Ghana, from the diaspora, or another part of the black African world. All right, so family, we're going to take a look at one of the rooms and then once, once we finish up our refreshments, we're going to head back to One Africa. Uh, we are taking a look at one of the rooms and then getting refreshments but down there if you want to do it. But it's all volunteer base. And if you're in the vehicle, have the driver keep the running with the AC on. You know, you notice one thing you see coming all over the place? The coconut tree. One of the strongest trees out there. It grows, look where it's growing at. Oh, that's one of my favorite trees. And I still think it's one of the, you know, one of those trees that's, you know, you, you know it's not getting the full effect use of it in a tropical situation. I mean, you have everything on there to do so many things. See, fam, in that, in that ocean water, look at it. You could just be here and just chilling and enjoying paradise. Enjoying the life away from all that toxic energy in the, un in the divided snakes. Not stress. Yeah? We in Africa, family. If you if you never left America, you have no idea what freedom is. Freedom is being able to just define your destiny. And being in Africa and being able to build is defining your destiny. Have everybody build everything for you and and charge you for everything. It's not freedom. It's subjugation. This one we have three beds in a room. See one, two, and then one behind you. Mm -hmm. So, yeah. so how much are the rooms? Sixty dollars a night, a hundred dollars a night? Oh, it depends. Mm -hmm. It sometimes all depends. Eighty dollars, sometimes eighty. Hey, the night. range will work. Sometimes it can be seventy, but it depends on the time. Right. Yes. So this need a range, you know. Yeah. We know so at that. least from seventy to hundred. CDs. There's a lot of beds. There's a lot of beds in this room. Yeah. In this room. That is, yeah. So if three of us, if three of us are sharing hundred dollars, is that not? 
It's over $30. So we got it one, two, three. Oh, so you were in charge? Come on, I'm not in charge. Yeah, that is awesome. Sure. Yeah. You can do that. If, two, yeah. if two people share $100, so that's $50, $50. Yeah. We got a best. Yeah, for, for a the nice best, too. Oh, yeah, yeah, nice, nice, nice. Nice bed, air conditioning, yeah. everything works. Oh, that's right. Yeah. Was well, yeah. this up and running? Or is it still up and running or what? Yes, yeah, still, still up and running. Where are we? I'm all for it. Oh. Where, where are oh. we? We're in an area called Ayensudu. Uh, the next Ayansudu. town is we're where we came from was Almira. Almira. Yeah. Almira. 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 You have Cape Coast, then Elmina, then I am Sudan. Yeah, if you do want to write something, just sit here. Yeah, I love this one. Oh, yeah. Yes, 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 family. We're enjoying this journey. Okay. Enjoy yourself, take as much as possible. I'm trying to open another room. And now, well, if they're all the same room, it's all good. Yeah. Unless you're going to show is, something completely different. No, this is three beds. We have two beds and one bed. But okay. all the same, the same time. All right, cool. Show, yeah. show something a little bit different, and then we'll close on that one. As we just uh, want to show you a few rooms, family. And the, the elevation when you go into the ocean is just a smooth drop down. And I like these resorts because you can get good exercise and you can enjoy nature. You can camp out and all that good stuff. There you go, family. This is the love of sweet right here. Oh, let me see the love of sweet. The love of sweet right there. And I would say something, but we're on camera. Uh, so I would save it for myself for later. This is the love of sweet right here. Well, I'm in love, all right. And then if you want some extra loving, you can add some extras. Oh, oh. <laughs> yeah. Oh, yeah. You can take it up a notch a little bit. But more little stories for me, you have a whole lot of space to spread out. So rooms are very clean, nice, organized. And you know, let me show you the ceiling. And what is this resort called? Brand New Beach, and that's spelled, pr pronounced and spelled B R E N N U. Brand New, yeah. Brand New family, Brand New Beach Resort. And you know me, family. Just, just want to show up all my brothers and sisters, not but love. Especially if you are here doing the work, trying to build something where other, where the rest of us need to come. Spend some of that hard-earned money. You know, whether in Europe or America, and come to Africa. You know, come invest. You know, but before you even invest, come and enjoy the paradise, so you can get a feel why you invest in. And that's what we have done over the period of time. You know, build up our level of investments in Ghana and other parts of Africa. Because if you don't invest your money, family, when you're in the system, it will just all go and go back to the system. Go ahead. No, I was just. Oh, the, the, the wave and energy. All right, so uh, Kwabena, we're gonna go down there and get a drink, and then we're gonna close out and head back, okay? Okay. Anything else we need to know? Oh, I think that is that. That's all. There you go, sir. Uh, I can also show you behind us. Uh, she has a very vast land. Let's let's okay. Let's go here. Let me show you. Oh. Is she here now? Your auntie here now? No, we said she's gone for. So if you wanted to rent here, how do you get in touch? Who do you get in touch with? How you Oh, I can give you my number. You can call me. Yeah, you know, it is. Everything is you have to know yeah. somebody. Yeah, yeah. So that's why we're trying to share information digitally. Yeah. Right, you're right. And, and that's okay. why we're trying to get people to everyone to have websites and email address and things like that because that's the only way we can share. And then, you know, when you build something like this, all the business in the world may not come, but five years from now, you can have an overflow of business based on oh, yeah. your marketing and what you built on the foundation. This goes down there. And then she, we, uh, she has started with another one also is going to come here. Now her land is beyond, uh, you see where the uh, uh, cement blocks yeah, are? Yeah. The yeah, stairs? That is where her land is. So what is so these stairs right here? She will be continuing, continue, continue building. So How far go that way? Yeah, you see where, where, where the uh, coconut tree is? Yes. Yeah, is. that is the end of it. Okay. That's the end of it. So you finish with this one. 
That one is going to be a story building. The ones over here are going to be a story building. A story? Yeah, story, uh, one story building. Oh, one story? Yeah. So all this place, then when you finish, we'll go to the other side. There's a woman who started from the scratch, nothing. And that's absolutely it? Absolutely nothing. Like 20 years ago, 10 years ago? Oh, about, about, about uh, a little, about 25 years ago. Wow. What she did was she was selling uh, uh, food in a tray. And she'll come and sit at this place and pass by us. Or buy, pass by. And then later, she was able to make some money and then went to the chief and said, you know what, I need a piece of land. I want to start something. And she started with the restaurant. Instead of carrying it there, she started with the restaurant. From the restaurant, she got into the accommodation. And now look at where she is. Oh, she's a lovely, lovely. She lost the husband, and uh, the husband was buried uh, there. Oh, Tell yeah, there, the what is that stairs looking thing up here? Yeah, it's, it's, uh, underneath is just a grave. Oh, that's so great. people can walk there, stand at top, and then you can just uh, pay your uh, homage. Uh, or whatever, okay. yes. It's just a staircase and over there the top is flat. Right. That you can see, yeah. And he was buried in between the staircase. Oh, wow. Yeah. Amazing. Yeah, yeah, that's him. Not him. That's a great yeah, more That's than, a great, yeah. More than one. That's, yeah. So what, so, what is the spaceship up here? Oh, over there is just a water reservoir. Water, water. Okay, perfect. Water reservoir. All right, so family, that's it. So family, hope you appreciate the view of brand new beach resort and we're gonna get ourselves organized and we're gonna head back to one africa resort in elmina and go get our lunch and then we're gonna head up to kakum national park for the canopy walk appreciate your family joining us on this wonderful journey as we show you more highlights of all the wonderful things that we're doing on our journey for lifetime in our favorite country ghana a country where we say you should join us for us to build a great african diaspora energy and make it a great representation of us in Africa. All right, so family, keep it strong. All right, let me see what... Yes, Mr. Man, yeah, you have something to share with me? Tell me, tell me yeah, you have something good. You have a bus driver to turn on the AC. Okay, I'll, I'll do that. I'll let him know. Okay, uh, I, I do see his point, so that's fine, son. We're about to walk to the bus now. Son, come on, come on, come on. Let's make a move. And this is a whole block of rooms. One block of five rooms.